Hey, Julian. Yes, Mog? You went to high school, right? It's been a really long time. I can barely remember. Well, good news. Now you can relive your lost youth with Life is Strange. Life is Strange is a high school choose-your-own-adventure drama. Or this. With each of the five episodes being about two to three hours of gameplay. Depending on how incompetent you are. Though produced by Square Enix, it was actually developed by Don't Not Entertainment. So you don't have to worry about any weird scenes. So, Julian, wouldn't you like to relive high school? Yes! Where am I? This is not my high school experience. Whoa. That Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Turns out our protagonist, Max Caulfield, was just having 1800s. some phony Your nightmare. generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Mr. Jefferson's dialogue illustrates that the writers were probably in their late the 30s, as the evidenced by the dated slang. Man, are you serial? Amazeballs. Nerd alert. And slang that never existed. Tats and dude. I saw her hanging with the other cool kids. Sad face. Ready for the mosh pit, shaka bra. Maybe not. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. Victoria is a rival photography student who so wants Mr. Jefferson's attention. Mr. Jefferson. And she's totes jelly of our photog skills. So cool to see Mr. Jefferson's actual published pictures. <laughs> <laughs> but it turns out Max is just Hella? impressed by everything. That printer is amazing. So cool that we can check these out anytime. That was amazing when Mr. Jefferson took a class picture the first week. Said Max, the art critic. No, you are most certainly not. You can never escape the lighthouse here. Yeah, especially when it falls on you. That's some nice aftershadowing. Yeah. Max finally takes a break from being amazed by everything and leaves the classroom, entering a high school hallway montage wherein we get to relive our high school experience of just standing around awkwardly and actively not stopping bullies. I wish I could beat the shit out of Logan. Rachel Amber, she's so pretty. Good riddance, Rachel Amber. And your two first names. Empty. Good. Nobody can see my meltdown. Why are you melting down? You were just so excited about the printers. I feel like the universe is taunting me everywhere I go today. God, you are 18. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. So what do you want? You got hella cash. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Oh boy, is this a very special episode of Degrassi? Get away from me, psycho! No! <laughs> He's like a little girl and talks to himself. Come don't on, put that ever thing down! Tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me! No way! Don't ever touch me again, freak! I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Julian? Do you realize what we can do with this power? We'll protect our friends and family. Rewind time to make all the boys love us. Oh, we'd be the best at high school. Right? John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Oh, this romantic desk lighting is perfect. Now's our chance to woo him. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers, good. Let's see what old Daniel here has to say. Would you mind letting me sketch you? Makes me feel like a muse. You're a good substitute muse. Wow, how is that virginity working out for you, champ? I was just thinking about my real muse, Rachel Amber. Yeah, keep, keep talking about Rachel. This action will have consequences. Bring it! Come to thrash? You mean stage diving? You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple nose slide or a tray flip, you should walk on. Okay, let's steal Nathan's gun and shoot this guy. Now, Mom, Come it's our responsibility to get Max a boyfriend and live slide. vicariously through her. But I'd love to see somebody do a tray flip. Oh, sick. You're not a poser. It worked! Now we're gonna thrash! Just wait for justice, you sheeple. All right, you're off the potential BF list. You okay? I'm kind of over humanity today. You knew Rachel? How can you know a prison? You just stare in awe. Uh, this guy totally murdered Rachel Amber. Oh wait, hold that pose. 
Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Long story short, you cover Victoria with paint. No way! No fucking you okay, way! okay, Victoria? Hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? Well, fine then. Kids, don't be this bitchy at home. Don't. Don't say a word, Max. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. And no filter needed before I post this. That was... Hella fucking... Satisfying. Well, I forget why we're here, but we're leaving now. It's really great that Max can interact with almost everything. And by interact, I mean give us really banal observations. Go Otters. Stella always looks so serious and dedicated. Good for her. What up, Max? How are you? Here's your flash. Thanks. Max, no Warren is the only guy you're Man, able to impress without rewinding. You can't, can't afford to friend zone him. Max Caulfield, right? I could call the police. Do it! The Prescotts own the pigs here. Get away from her, dude! <laughs> Max? Chloe? No way. You again. Warren! Go! Go! I got this! Nathan Prescott is messed up. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. Your friend really stood up for you. Warren? Oh yeah, we left him to die, didn't we? You came back for Blackwell Academy. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. Oh! You're talking about when I was 12 years old, and my parents and I moved away. Chloe, well, just keep your eyes on the road. If you dumping me are even life. moving them. This isn't exactly my chill out zone. My step fear makes sure of that. Oh hey, is this our best friend mix from when we were 12? Chloe alarm. figures out that That's Max hella saved your life. You. you hella saved my life. But I'm Chloe's dad people. interrupts their bonding time. Hide now. Is it grass? You got this, Chloe. Surely your stepdad just cares about your happiness. Oh. This is Chloe takes Max to their favorite spot in Always Sunset in Arcadia and inks out. I'd like to drop a bomb on Arcadia Bay and turn it to fucking glass. Max can't take her bitching anymore and returns to her prophetic nightmare world. October 11th? Is this Friday? What's going on? You totally blacked out. Our storm is coming. Max, start from the beginning. I'll tell you everything, Chloe. As you reminded me, we were best friends when we were 12. The next morning, Max gets a text from Chloe at 7.30 asking to meet in 40 minutes, proving that not only are these writers over 35, but that they were never teenagers. It's a new day, so Max has more fairly fucking cool observations to make about things she comes across. Rollerblades. That video of you clubbing didn't look like homework. Victoria, that wasn't me. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> You're going to be sorry someday. Kate, you in there? Yes, I'm here. Come in, Max. Max sees how devastated Kate is and goes... You, you saw your sad friend across her unlit gloomy room, and you immediately started looking at her shit. It was good shit! How do I get a viral video taken down? You know how humiliating this is for me? And ended up making out with a bunch of people. And I have no memory of it. Did somebody drug you? I remember getting sick and dizzy. And I woke up in a room. Somebody was talking to me in a soft voice. I thought it was a doctor until I heard Nathan and felt a sharp sting in my neck. And... And... Oh. Oh, I guess that's a good reason for losing faith in humanity. Ooh, this is a little dark. Let's just go save this bird so that we can help someone's life. Uh, saving a bird has consequences? The consequences being that we have a bird friend now. Jesus Christ, where's the hug button? You can rewind time, Max. That's fucking insane. We have to play. Chloe abuses Max's powers by making her go with her to her secret dumpy lair where she graciously lets you find five frustratingly difficult to find beer bottles in a junkyard to then help her shoot said bottles by reversing time to tell her where to aim. I don't think anyone involved with this game has ever shot a gun. I want to get creative here. Goodbye, cruel bumper. Jesus, I shot myself! You know, we've wasted the last hour of our lives, and unlike this game, we can't rewind to get it back. Come on, girly. Shoot me. But uh, gun fun is short-lived when Chloe's drug dealer like takes the gun as compensation. 
Frank took Chloe's gun because of me. That's fine, the only danger to Chloe is herself. And this train. Aren't you glad I took you away to a nice, quiet, desolate spot? I didn't think she was that messed up. Is this for real? Kate! Max becomes weak from rewinding, but discovers she can still freeze time to get to Kate before it's too late. I only want to help you. I wish you could. It's too late now. Thankfully, we Hella? saved her life too. No wonder they call it a web. Nothing can ever get out. She did try to kill herself all over a video. Viral is the right word. Like a disease. Ah, there's the Square Enix writing. You. Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. And then they both Hella? flicked into a solar eclipse. The end. Wish we could just hang out all morning. Oh Christ. man, I wish we could rewind far enough Maybe to prevent you from getting those tattoos. He's gotta be hiding shit. While snooping in Chloe's stepdad's oh, garage, Max finds evidence of him stalking Kate and confronts him. Surveillance cameras, so he can spy on everybody. Like he spies on all of us here. I mean... All the guns and bottles. Nah, screw you, David. I don't want to see or hear you again, Max. You've hurt me and my family enough. Hey, you want to talk about it? Look, the, the door's right there. Do you need someone to open it for you? Max, don't beat yourself up. Oh, trust me, Joyce. We're not. Oh man, this game is Hella? great. I wish we could reverse time and ruin David's life all over. Uh, what's happening? I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. So, so Max cute. finds herself in better times, specifically the time before young Chloe's dad gets into a fatal car accident. Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. You can take the bus, right? The stop is right down the street. This I can do. Good call, Max. I'm off to yonder bus stop. Max, you are being so fucking strange. You feel okay? Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome! Turns out some actions do have consequences. Hello, are you even listening, Maxine? Oh, wow, so now Victoria's our friend? We're in the cool kids club? Uh, maybe, maybe scratch that spelling. <gasps> is, is Warren our boyfriend now? Go get your man, Max! Wait, what? There's Warren, but he's with... Stella! Oh, and Chloe's crippled too, I guess. <laughs> You saw your sad friend across an unlit, gloomy room, and you decided to start looking at her shit. <laughs> yeah, Mog. To find something to cheer her up. A violin. I was gonna play her a song. People love violin music. It's complicated. It's really hard.